everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today what I wanted to talk to you about is extensions. It has been a hot minute since this was a topic that I discussed on my channel. Um, the last video that I did was about how much I hate Bellamy extensions and I still stand by that. Today I wanted to review Lexi Hair extensions for you. Lexi Hair reached out to me and asked if I would like to review a pair of extensions and I was like, duh. I picked out the Vibrant Auburn number 33 20 inch 160 grams Lexi hair clip-in hair extensions. This is what I received. These are the 160 gram 20 inch extensions. Stent actual extensions came in a box like this. This was the top piece for the tester and then all the other extensions were in here. There is a, another little baggie of the clips. I want to say that there are two in here just in case any of them come off. In this pack, there are four single wefts, two clip, two wefts, two, three clip wefts, two, four clip wefts, wefts. Am I saying that right? I feel like to say that word so much, I like actually should know the specific <laughs> pronunciation of that word, but you know, this is me, so <laughs> welcome. I did have to dye these to match my hair color. The Vibrant Auburn was way too light and I have like a mahogany red color, and this is the final result. I will have the video on how I dyed these and kind of tips and tricks on that. So this but is my natural hair, there's nothing clipped in here. It's not short, but it's not long. I'm gonna go and clip these in and I will be right back. Obviously, I now have the extensions in. As you can see, it uh, really took my hair all the way down here. And now it looks really nice and long and voluminous and like I was just born a freaking queen. This is what the back looks like. So let me go ahead and give you some information and then kind of do a little bit of a comparison. I'm going to be comparing the Lexi hair to Bellamy hair just because they are the big two powerhouses in the industry. I'm going to be screen recording the screens that I'm looking at just to be able to show you what I am looking at. Just in general, appearance wise from the websites, Lexi just looks so much more put together, nice and organized and clean, and then you look at Bellamy and it just doesn't look very professional to me. Another thing that really stood out to me is the behind the company type of story. So both websites do have our, our, our story tabs. Um, this one I had to go all the way down to about. Um, so instead of it being nice and prime up at the top somewhere, it's, it's really not. This was very important to me because I did a lot of research on where this hair comes from that is put into hair extensions and wigs and things of that sort. And it's a very, very lucrative business, but it's also a very kind of sketchy business because people in those countries use that as a source of income. And females will grow their hair out and when they need money, they will have people come in to cut their hair and then they will sell it. So the problem is that lots and lots of women in these countries are being taken advantage because they're not being paid a fair wage for the hair. On Lexi Hair, when you click on our story, there's the behind the product. Um, it talks about that it's real Remy human hair clipping extensions and what Remy is, the prices, the packaging, they are environmentally friendly, um, and then it talks about the factory here, how it is in China. So they are disclosing their location where they do make the hair, and it kind of shows a little behind the scenes of how this hair happens. Um, they made a big deal about how they found the factory and why they decided to go with this specific factory in China. And then they also talk about the materials. All hair is donated, sold, or exchanged freely and fairly. Donors benefit from selling hair as it is a supplementary source of income that does not require any labor. Many hair salons also choose to sell hair instead of disposing it into the waste stream accumulation of which causes numerous environmental, environmental problems. While I wanted to do that with Bellamy and this is all that you get. It's basically like, oh, this is what our name means. Oh, everyone deserves beautiful hair. Like, if you have any questions, email us. That's it. There's nothing about the factory. There's nothing about where the hair comes from, which to me makes it a little bit sketchy because if you're not disclosing the information, then you seem like you're hiding something. So that was very important to me, and Luxie obviously wins in that category because they are disclosing way more information. It do make me feel better about buying this hair and knowing that Someone was paid a fair wage, 
so that's great that makes me feel better so then you go and you shop your hair so they have the classic collection and then they have the seamless collection I ended up going with the classic collection and I'm going to open that up and then I'm also going to open up the seamless collection um, so the classic collection is clip and hair extensions with a soft fabric stitched base choose from three weights for added volume and then the seamless collection is clip and hair extensions with a thin flat silicone base virtually undetectable comes in one weight um, so you have volumizer lefts as well you have luxury hair extension carriers with Luxie if you're going with the classic you get to choose uh, from 120 grams to 160 grams to 220 grams the 120 is for thin hair 160 is for regular hair and 220 is for thick short hair um, there are videos on how to choose your thickness so then you get to choose all these different colors let's go to vibrant auburn because that is what I did so the 120 gram extensions are $129 and then the 160 grams are 159 and then the 220s I'm just gonna do them all in the same color so then the 220s are 209 yeah so if you're doing it by grams, the Bellamy extensions for 120 grams is 129 and for 160 grams is 159. So the prices are absolutely the same for the seamless collection. It is just one size, going to whatever color. So the seamless 20 inches, 180 grams is $199. So basically this technology is just a silicone. It's not really like it's just a little bit of a different of a clip-in situation. It's supposed to be not detectable, but like, I really like, I don't think anyone would be able to recognize the fact that I have extensions in just by anything being exposed. They match really well to the color of the hair. I don't think that that's a problem if you're looking for a regular pair of extensions and you're not really worried about anything like showing, then... The classic collection is fine for you. I think these are way higher quality than Bellamy ever was, is, and will be. They are absolutely the length that they're advertised to be, and they feel super, super great, and they keep the curl really amazing, they look good in the hair, they blend really well, and I am very happy in those terms. The only cons for me was the fact that they were a little hard to dye. I did have to dye them twice to get the color that I wanted, which is kind of strange to me. I've never had that problem before. Um... So I don't know what happened there. Maybe they have like a thicker coating on top to protect the hair from damage. Not quite sure. Kind of is a con, but if it's because of the higher protection to the hair, then that's fine. I just dyed it twice and now it's the color that I need it to be. And like I said, the quality is so great that even after dyeing it twice, it is so smooth and like there's no split ends and it just feels and looks really nice and healthy. I honestly would say 100% that these are the best extensions on the market for the price because all extensions are pretty much the same price at this point. I would definitely recommend everyone to check these out. Um, Christmas is right around the corner. They could be doing some specials around the Christmas time. If I find any deals, I will link that down below in the description box and yeah. That is all that I have to say. Thank you so much for Lexi Hair for sending me a pair. I am obsessed. I will continue wearing them and feeling bougie and like a queen. So appreciate you allowing me to have that in my life. And if you have any other questions, go ahead and leave them down below if I didn't happen to answer something. And yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.